What's up guys, Matt from SB Fishing TV here from Mystery Tackle Box and today I have an amazing and innovative lure that I can't wait to share with you and I think it's really going to make a difference this winter and that is the Mighty Minnow by Smart Baits. So the Mighty Minnow is your standard fluke style bait, it has a nice dugout body there so you're not going to have to worry about getting your hook all the way through all that plastic. Um, and you can fish this so many different ways. Personally, I like to fish this as a moving bait. I like to throw it on a chatter bait with no skirt and just fish it like that. But you can throw it on a standard fluke rig, you can drop shot it, you can throw it on a swim jig head, you can use it as a swim jig trailer, as a regular jig trailer, you can Texas rig it. There are really endless possibilities in how you fish a fluke style bait like this. So Smart Baits is a very, very interesting, unique, and innovative brand in the sense that they're actually making color-changing lures, and I think that's really going to entice some strikes and you know just give fish something that they have never seen before. So when you're fishing the Mighty Minnow in shallower, warmer water, it's going to give off a lighter presentation and the color will be lighter, and then when you drag it off into the depths and it gets a little bit cooler and deeper, this bait is actually going to change to a darker color and give off almost a bleeding presentation which these big bass have never seen and I think that's really going to entice some strikes in the winter time and anytime you're fishing this fluke style bait. So as I was saying earlier you can fish this bait pretty much all year long but as winter is coming up this is where this thing really stands out for me. Uh, I like to throw this as a spinnerbait trailer, I like to throw it on a drop shot, on a chatterbait such as this and there's so many different ways that you can truly fish a fluke styled bait like this Mighty Minnow. And in the winter time, I would suggest start fishing this in deeper points, you know, whether you're drop shotting it if the water's clean or you want to slow roll it on a big spinner bait trailer or a chatter bait such as this. You know, points and deep drop offs are always a good spot to start looking for bait fish on the graph and then throwing on the Mighty Minnow, dragging it through those bait balls, looking for any fish that are suspended around it trying to catch yourself a big bass. Again, I'm fishing the Mighty Minnow as a moving bait. Today I have it on a chatter bait. And when I'm fishing it, I'm looking for wind. I really like fishing in the wind because generally your fish are gonna be a little bit more active in these areas. So I'll get on a bank that I can find that's nice and wind blown. Or whether I'm fishing a point or a deep drop off, I always like to look for the wind. And I'm gonna experiment with the retrieve. So sometimes I'll slow roll it and just let it go right on the bottom and tick off of any sort of cover. Other times I'll be reeling it really erratically and giving the rod a ton of pops. You just really want to let the fish tell you what they want. And then when you get that bite, you got to try to remember exactly what you're doing. So you really have to pay attention to how you were fishing the bait when you got the bite. Because a lot of times you can replicate that and catch more fish the same way. Alright guys, that's it for me and the Mighty Minnow by Smart Baits. Let me know in the comments below if you've had any success fishing these color changing lures and your thoughts on them. So I'll see you guys in the next video. And make sure you hit that like button and subscribe to Mystery Tackle Box's YouTube channel if you want to see more tips and tricks just like this one. See you guys.